In this video we share blessed Anna Maria Tighe's prophecy of the three days of darkness. What did the mystic Anna Maria Tighe say about the possible end of the church? It is one of the prophecies that heralds radical changes. Blessed Anna Maria Tighe, the Holy Father will be forced to leave Rome, after three days of darkness, Saints Peter and Paul will appoint a new Pope. Blessed Anna Maria Tighe, 1769-1837, was a special mystic who had the gift of the sun from one evening in 1791 until her death. It is a mirror that I am showing you, which serves you to understand good and evil, Jesus told her. Anna Marie Tighe's visions and prophecies were most unique. It was a light she saw about 12 feet away, 3 feet above her head. That vision lasted 47 years and was the source of her revelations. So Anna Maria Tighe described places she had never seen and talked about events that would happen to important figures of her time and those that followed. All these events have happened so far. From the defeat of Napoleon's army in Russia, to the latter's death. She talked about the war in Greece, about the revolution of 1830 in Paris, about the death of many rulers. Again, natural disasters and the pontificate of Giovanni Mastai Ferretti, Pope Pius IX. God will send two punishments, one will be in the form of wars, revolutions and other evils, will arise on earth. Another will be sent from heaven. A great darkness will come to the earth that will last for three days and three nights. Nothing will be visible, and the air will be noxious and pestilential and will cause harm, though not exclusively to the enemies of religion. During these three days, artificial light will be impossible, only blessed candles will burn. During these days of terror the faithful will have to stay in their homes praying the rosary and begging God for mercy. All the enemies of the church, visible and unknown, will disappear on earth during this total darkness, except for those few who will convert. The air will be infested with demons that will appear in all kinds of hideous forms. Faith will be persecuted and priests will be massacred. Churches will be closed, but only for a short time. The Holy Father will be forced to leave Rome. France will plunge into terrible anarchy. The French will have a terrible civil war in which even the old will take up arms. The political parties, having exhausted their blood and fury, without being able to reach any satisfactory solution, will agree, as a last resort, to resort to the Holy See. Then the Pope will send a special legate to France. After receiving the information, His Holiness will personally appoint a Christian king to govern France. After three days of darkness, Saint Peter and Saint Paul will appoint a new Pope, then Christianity will spread throughout the world. He is the Holy Pope whom God has chosen to weather the storm. In the end, he will be endowed with miracles and his name will be praised throughout the land. Whole nations will return to the church and the face of the earth will be renewed. Russia, England and China will enter the church. Please like, share and subscribe to support my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.